So here we are, Cooper Lake, Cleelum, Washington. A mountain lake, obviously. Hopefully, you can see the snow and the sharp peaks in the distance. Kind of windy today, so I'm gonna end up staying somewhat close to shore. Kind of make it a little easier. Going right into the wind this way, so coming back will be a lot easier. In the winter, this lake freezes completely over. I've never seen it not freeze completely over, so and, and enough to where you can actually walk across it all over the place on on the ice, of course. Make up a little ground here. All colors are starting to come out. Just starting. Let's see. Uh, fine maple that you see there. I think that is one of my top few trees that I really like. They're just so colorful. They're usually the last to leave out after winter or butt out. The first one to drop, turn colors and drop after summer. Here we come back around to the see the end of the lake. In case you're wondering, these are the part of the Cascade Mountains, Cascade Range. Actually, the namesake for my brand. Totally beautiful. Sure is pretty, isn't it, hon? Holy cow. Normally you wouldn't have to paddle this hard, but we're paddling directly into the wind. trout in this water. I've caught them before. A few different little places. These are all like I, I'd call them fishing places. That's what I use them for. Not too many weeds in the lake. That's nice. There are some. It's not very deep. Maybe right where I'm at I'm going to guesstimate between 8 and 10, 10 maybe 12 feet deep is all. That uh, fine maple color there, that red, that's very common as the season gets progresses. It, more and more of these will turn that color, and they turn yellow and orange on the way to that color. some uh, turn give you a 360 view oh. got a visitor had a dragonfly visitor Oh, it's nice and calm up here at this end of the lake. Very peaceful. I'm glad we went. Yeah. Where's Yellowy? Oh, let me get a picture of him on the, with Grandma. <laughs> Where's he riding? Oh. You can picture that too for Lucas. <laughs> Can't 
see them with their thing in the way. There we go. Cool. Wow, what a great day. What a wood duck. Yeah. I see four of them. Too bad they're right in the sun. I don't think the video's going to show anything. You see any fish? I haven't seen any yet. Two of them are having bad hair days. <laughs> Super bad hair days. Yeah. Is that where the inlet is? Definitely can't put your paddle very deep into the water. Right here is probably only about six or eight inches deep. So, okay, here's the deeper part. This must be the middle of the channel. Is there a sandbar there? No, it's just shallow. Oh, real shallow, huh? I didn't mean sand, mud bar, I guess, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's what is that like? Oh, it's probably about six inches or five inches deep. <laughs> Woo! It's pretty in here. Way deeper too. Crystal clear though, holy cow. Not like rivers I see elsewhere in this country. These Washington rivers or Northwest rivers tend to run very clear, except for when there's major snow melt and then you get the glacial till and such or flooding, then of course they're not. But the rest of the time, I mean, come on, look how clear this is. Really cool. Really, really cool. I don't know if you'll be able to see under the level of the water here. But it's, it's really neat. Super crystal clear. But I haven't seen one fish of any size in here today. Really cool. Very peaceful.
So what are you thinking? Kind of maybe go over here a little bit around this point and then kind of diagonal across so we don't have to go like all the way down and then turn and then fight upwind to come up or do you want to circle the whole lake and do that? Okay. Go along. The water here is way colder than the lake. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. Several degrees colder. Are you going to get out on that island? Yeah. <laughs> I'm that way. Huh? I'm that way a little bit. Oh, is it looking really shallow? Okay. Maybe that's why there's an island, huh? <laughs> Starting to get out into the wind again. Water's a little rougher, but at this time it's at our back, so that's all right. There are a couple of campgrounds to my right, to the right of the camera. Not campgrounds, campsites. Somebody put up a bench. Fire pit, little one. Nice. Holy cow. Look at the size of that monster. Cedar. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I wonder if I can make it across this log that's floating. I don't know if it's floating, but it's in the water. We'll find out. We'll find out shortly. Oh yeah, should be easy. Nah, yeah, no problem. Oh, except for hitting that stob. Just fabulous. Oh, there's an eagle right up there in that tree. Bald eagle. Below its nest. Way cool. Okay, well, let's get back across the lake. Big old tree stump. Easy peasy.